Ah, feels like a heat wave out here. Uh, it's actually like 32 degrees outside, but considering it's been in the single digits, this feels so nice, which is why my jacket's unzipped. But today, it is time to get the mirror out of the back of the bus. So Abby's coming out to help me out. We're gonna get this behemoth moved, and uh, hopefully, nobody will get hurt in the process. What do you mean looks precarious? You know you have a light on back here? Huh? You know you have a light on back here? Yeah. It's on because the door's on. Oh. The door's open. Alright, what's the plan? Get it out. Are we going in through the little door? Yeah. I can't even pick this up. Holy cow! <laughs> Well, we are back in the bus, and it's changed quite a bit um, as far as when I first got it. It is starting to become more of the blank slate that we were hoping it would be when we picked it up. So there's lots to do today. I was kind of hoping to be able to take the soffit down on the other side um, and start pulling stuff down so basically it can get down to the skeleton. So I can take it to a buddy of mine who um, said that he would help me with some soldering stuff so we can get the frame and everything else set up. However, before I do that, um, the soffit on this side was pulled out for me and there were a lot of cables that were cut. And uh, unfortunately, um, or fortunately, um, a lot of these cables had um, clips that were not that far away from it before they got sliced so what I want to do is make sure that I label and I know exactly what I'm cutting or what it was already cut so that I can either resolder some of this stuff back in um, but when I take the rest of this stuff out that stuff will all be labeled so that whenever I put a new socket in whether it's this one or a different one at least we'll all know exactly you know where things stand with that so that was the goal for today um so i'm gonna sit here for a little bit um figure out what wires go to what on here label them as best i can and um yeah we'll see what we can get get done the rest of the day Well, the good news is I think I know um, what cables I don't need uh, because I'm going to be taking all of the interior lighting stuff and changing it over other than maybe um, some of these lights. Um, I can get rid of a lot of the cables that are run through that line and then just keep the audio cables that I need. And of course the cables that are going back to the back of the bus. So good thing is there's stuff we're gonna keep. Now I just gotta go through and pull the stuff that I don't need anymore, get rid of that, and keep the stuff that I do. Uh, next to come out is probably gonna be the soffit mount. We'll go get my screw gun, start pulling this out, um, and then we gotta move the bench out of the way so we can move it up and get behind there and got lots to do.
want to watch this video today? It's gonna go right now. Well, we're making some progress. Got the bench out of here. That drawer is underneath. I gotta decide whether or not I wanna slide this all the way over and re-bolt it to the floor, or if we're gonna grab the other bench and put it there instead since it would be a little bit shorter. So I gotta get this thing out the door now. But uh, soffit's gone. Um, which is good. It actually, I'm glad that that happened that way because it allowed me to actually be able to figure out um, how the wiring on the other side was actually done. So, little chunks at a time, but uh, I think the frame um, of the bench may come out um, just so we can. I'm really feeling like I need to replace the floors. I know for sure I need two in the back, um, but there's just so many holes in them. In fact, I think there's a black water tank, or a gray water tank. It would just be gray water. I think there's a gray water tank um, that probably needs to come out because we're not going to use it for anything. Um, that's just an open valve right now down on the floor down there. So, it's coming along. Well, as you can tell, it gets pretty dark. Which, I mean, I shouldn't complain. It's getting dark later. It's like 8.17 now. But, uh, teardown of the bus is going pretty well. 
pretty excited at how far it's come. Thanks so much for tagging along, checking this video out. Uh, if you wanna see more bus videos, feel free to click on the playlist and you can see more of those. Uh, again, I'm super pumped because this bus is gonna allow me to be able to serve uh, people through music more and allow our family to be able to serve in ways we weren't able to before. So we're super excited to get it done. It's definitely a process and it's taken longer than, well, everything that you know, takes time is worth it, but it always seems to take a little bit longer than we want it to, but that's okay. Thanks so much for watching. Feel free to like, share, and subscribe. We will see you next time.